Let's change the language. A lot of languages supported. English, please. Okay, I want the right. Oh, no, I don't want the right. I want to confirm. Okay, thanks. Tap the screen. Okay. RFID, boom, plug surfing, but you can pay with Visa even and Google Pay. Boom, CCS. There goes the Tesla. One push of the button, boom, it opens. Connect the plug. four percent in the battery I don't think it's super hot but let's see what happens <laughs> look at this great great setup Chatamo and CCS no AC charging here sorry for the old-school Zoe drivers but uh, time to move up somebody uh, if you want to go for a car wash it's all possible but I really like this lineup we are in Permarent that's my dad over there at the Shell station hello obviously no roof here the luxury of a roof is still something for the total and Fastnet thank you Fastnet and now the question is, will we see a big boost in speed, actual charging speed? I think we will. Hello, hello. Yes, we're going to 100 plus. Thank you very much. Welcome back to the Model 3 SR Plus by UFO Drive, UFO Drive if you want. Music starts playing again. I'm sorry about that. Let's pause it. Uh, ooh, look at this 127. Definitely not a very warm battery again, but still, I mean, fine speed, of course. Powered by the Effacheck chargers from Portugal. Here's where the power comes from, obviously. HV HV160 again. I think these are the same as Tango, the Tango electric station in Harderwijk, where it was before. Well, fine charging speed for a battery that's not really hot because I couldn't do any speeding because it's before 7 p.m. and then the rules say in the Netherlands you can only do. 100 kilometers per hour nowadays thank you uh, environmental rules and on the way back home we can go full speed again how much range do I actually need well let's keep it up for a little bit I'll check back with you later but uh, 130 kilowatts is a good speed thank you Allego and Shell Recharge and plug surfing for the charging card. See you later.